In Malaysia, city volunteers invited aid recipients to celebrate the Chinese New Year together. Some Indian aid recipients also enjoy holiday festivities at this event. In Kota Tinggi, Malaysia, Siji volunteers have invited Indian aid recipients to celebrate the Chinese New Year together. So Majiswari is preparing Indian food. I am happy that Siji gave my kids tuition aid so they can go to school. Sithra and her husband are also busy making Indian food for the get-together as a way to express their gratitude. I want to celebrate this special occasion together. Tsuji has helped me before, so I want to repay. So I need you. Though they are Indian, they can still feel the abundant festivity. And with each passing year, so does the gratitude in their hearts grow. I often tell my sons that we must thank Tsuji and never forget their kindness. In Sangye Patanin Kadakh, it's the second year that Tsuji volunteers held a gathering in this Tamil primary school. Students there presented a story on the Neonli lamp to express their gratitude towards their parents, and their parents were deeply moved. It's hard to imagine the crime rate used to be high in this community, but with love and care, children have changed, and their parents have learned to give. I save 10 cents every day. It will be three ringgits a month. I had a hard life before. At the gathering in Johor Baru's Jinsu Hall, first-time participants Ha Ichi and her parents would not have been here without Suji's help. I feel dizzy, nauseous, and didn't have much of an appetite, but I still hung on. Ha is lucky to have found a matching donor through Suji and the family has a new wish this year. I wish we have an opportunity to go to Taiwan to thank my daughter's donor. With gratitude and best wishes, all welcome the new year with joy.